So what's up everyone, it's me Mr. Mario, and uh, please excuse the mess here, but as you can see I'm setting up this computer, this is actually the surprise computer that I built uh, from the ground up for my mother. So she doesn't know about this or anything, but uh, I wanted to talk about something. So I built this thing, it, I mean, it, it's not a powerful gaming PC, okay, don't expect a crisis on it, but uh, right now it's just running integrated graphics, I have a uh, AMD A4 processor, I don't remember what exactly it is, but it's 3.3 gigahertz clocked at that stock dual core, uh, got the DVD burner, um, a nice little ASRock motherboard, it's just a uh, micro ATX motherboard, 430 watt power supply, and uh, before this when I was setting it up, I didn't have any fans in there, I only had the uh, CPU fan and the CPU heatsink, that was it. So I decided to order some fans, so I got four fans, I ordered five but I only put four in, I got an outtake fan right here, I got two huge intake fans right here. I also have a third intake fan. I don't know if you all can see it, but it's in here. So, this is what happened. I ran this little program called Specky, which I used to think was good. And this is what convinced me to get some fans. As you can see, oh yeah, it's an AMD uh, A4 5300. There we go. It's running at 70, 72 degrees, 70, 71 degrees, 73 degrees. It keeps fluctuating. At one point, I even saw it at 85. So, I saw that, but it looks like my motherboard's okay. So I saw that and I'm like, oh, wow, I should really get some fans. Now, I ordered the fans, I installed them, and my CPU seems to be running a few degrees hotter. And it doesn't really seem stable. I mean, check that out. Now, see, here's the thing. As you all know, I, I work on Xboxes a bit. And normally my Xboxes run anywhere from 50 to 65 degrees Celsius. And I'm not going to lie, I mean, the uh, I guess that's okay for motherboard, uh, well, the, the system, because really... Xboxes don't have the best cooling system, but after like five minutes of running it, the CPU uh, heat sinks and uh, the GPU heat sinks, they always get hot. They always get hot. Like you touch them and they're very, very noticeably hot. So as you can see, look, I mean, it just decreased down to 66, 68. See, this is not stable at all. So I decided, I was like, hmm, you know, I've been running this computer for about 20 minutes. I'm going to see how hot it is. Now, first off, this is going to be very loud because my phone speed, uh, microphone's pretty uh, pretty sensitive, but we're going to go ahead and open this up, and you're going to see it sounds like a freaking wind tunnel in here, okay, with all these fans, so let's go ahead and open it up, hear that, I mean, uh, also excuse the cable management, honestly there's not much I can do because there's really not that much behind the computer that I can really do, so I know some of you are probably yelling at me about cable management, but unfortunately there's, there's not too much, I'm going to clean it up, but there's not too much I can do with this case, but it was a cheap case. So anyways, here is the heat sink right here, just the stock heat sink, and I'm feeling it right now, and it is not even warm. It is not even warm, you guys. It is, it is below room temperature, honestly. Just me touching it, like if this was at 70 degrees, my computer should be super slow. Uh, it should be giving me, you know, warnings, possibly just shutting down, and uh, I should not be able to have my hand on this heat sink for about a minute or two while I'm talking because this heat sink would be burning up my fingers. I mean, I'm, I'm, te I'm running it at high performance right now. That is what it's clocked at. On Windows, I have it running at high performance. And I'm touching this thing, and it's not even lukewarm. Like, not anywhere close to that. As I said, it is below room temperature. But, according to Specky, that's not the case. It's running dangerously hot. But I thought Specky might be inaccurate, so I decided to come over to my main computer over here, and oh, what is this? What is this? I did a nice little Google search for Specky inaccurate temps, and inaccurate motherboard temperature, uh, Specky inaccurate CPU temperature, which is what I had, and uh, as you can see, this person says their CPU, well, I don't know if you all can see it, but I'll read it, their CPU is running at 89 degrees Celsius, which is almost 200 degrees Fahrenheit. Is this correct? This person said, you are not crazy. The temperature readings are incorrect. It states that my hard drive is 216 degrees Celsius. To the touch, it is maybe 32 degrees Celsius. Otherwise, my whole machine would have melted by now or at least shut down due to disk failure. You see? And also right here on Tom's Hardware, these are on that official uh, P-Reform site, which is the, uh, this is the company that makes Specky. Now, uh, down here on Tom's Hardware, Somebody saying, ASRock Extreme Tooting Utility showed my CPU temp is 25 degrees Celsius idle, while Specky is showing 43. And then other people come here and say that Specky's just really not that good. So, Specky, you are fired, okay? I don't even care if you're a free program. I mean, this is a bit unacceptable. I mean, come on. 
you're telling me, look, it's not even stable. I walked over here, it went from 65 to 75 right now, as I'm talking, 77, 79, 80, okay, now, now I should be worried. See, look at that, it's going red, it's going red, look at that. But, apparently, let's go ahead and feel it again. As you can see, I mean, I showed you all, I got this fan, is this fan even running? Let me check. Yeah, that fan's running, yep, yep. I got the intake fan here, I got the outtake right here, I got two intake fans over here. R one right on top of the freaking motherboard and one covering the rest of it. But, oh, damn, damn. As you can see, I feel this thing. Shit. Feeling it? This CPU, I mean, the heatsink is cold now. It is cold. I've had this closed up for long enough that the heatsink itself is actually cold. If it was running at 70, 80 degrees, this thing should be burning up right now and I should be taking my hand off of the CPU every two seconds. So, Specky, you're fired.